Hey there guys, how are you today and welcome to a new video on my channel. So today I want to be kind of advertising my new fantasy F1 league. Of course, the Formula 1 themselves, Liberty, have created this. It's a little bit like Premier League fantasy football. But this is of course for Formula 1, with Formula 1 drivers, Formula 1 teams. So I obviously signed up for I've joined other leagues, but I've created my own leagues for mainly small F1 YouTubers, but anyone who's like subscribed to all of our channels and that kind of thing, more than welcome. And it'd be great if you guys can join. Okay, I've already got three people in the league at the moment, one of which is myself, so we have to uh, cross over that, but hopefully it can grow. And we'll see how we do, and maybe if there's enough people to make it worthwhile and enough people do it until the end of the season, maybe I'll have to think of some kind of prize for the winner at the end of the season. Because chances are, it won't be me. So before we start, we'll just say the code, which I tweeted out earlier. So I have to go up here on my Twitter. You can all see it anyway. The code is 7D963A. I'm sure you guys can see it there. I'm going to leave it in the description of this video. So yeah, come and join. It'll be a bit of fun every week. Of course, maybe every... Uh, after every race, I'll see how we're all doing. Look at everyone's teams, and yeah, that's actually what I'm gonna do now. So let's look at the teams that are in it so far. So we've got Robbie here. Of course, he's got a, a YouTube channel. He got 85 points in the last race, and let's see who he he had picked. He picked Leclerc. Did well. Hulkenberg. Uh, yeah, we know what happened to him. Ricardo, Alonso, and Alonso was his turbo driver, and Ocon. And then for the team, he chose Renault. So yeah, you can see it was certainly mixed for him. It wasn't the best weekend for all of those drivers, but he's got quite a strong team in my opinion. So I think he's going to be strong if he mainly has those drivers, because of course you can only make one change per race. So it's going to be a similar team for Spain, and I reckon he can do really well. Moving on, we've got... Red Nick Grand Prix, which is basically Nikal, who's also got a, a, a small YouTube channel for F1, and he had picked Raikkonen, Alonso, Hulkenberg, Ricardo, and Gasly. So of course, it looks like Hulkenberg and Ricardo are both quite popular choices, and it looked like he didn't go so well for them. But Alonso did well, Raikkonen did well, and Gasly did okay as well. And he chose McLaren for his team, and they did okay. Of course, got double points, so he'd be really happy with that. Now finally I'm going to show you my team, which is, which was anyway, I might I think I'm changing it before uh, this week's Grand Prix, I don't really know who I change. You got Hamilton, Alonso, Ocon, who didn't go so well, Magnussen and Vettel, so I think I've got a strong team, because surely Hamilton, Alonso and Vettel are the three top drivers still in Formula 1, and I managed to somehow squeeze them all into the team. Ocon is a good driver, and Magnussen's a good driver, I think I might... I can work out how an um, edit team now in front of you guys see so mag if I can get out get rid of Magnuson so I've currently got 2.4 million budget remaining Magnuson is 7.4 so I can have any driver that's 9.8 so let's have a look at that 9.8 I could have a stroll no thank you Van Dorn don't think so. There's Magnussen, Gasly, Sirotkin, Hartley, Grosjean, and the clerk. Mm, maybe not. Maybe I should stick with Magnussen for this one. I think I'm, I could have other drivers like under Perez maybe. If I sold, if I de got rid of Ocon, but I don't want to do that. So I think I'm going to keep it going for now, as it is. Sorry for false hope, giving you false hope that I'm going to change my team. So yeah, you saw you know, there's my league there. And I hope some of you guys come and join it, and we can have fun here, which will be what we want to see. And we're going to see who wins. And yeah, I'll see you guys next week, reviewing how everyone did for this at the Spanish Grand Prix.